Hey, I'm Aubrey St. John from Cessna Team Structures. Today I'm just going to be doing a quick video on batch editing images, uh, resizing that is, um, or sending to Team Structures for evaluation. So we'll get right into it. One common issue with documenting aircraft conditions is emailing all the photographs in a single email while maintaining the high resolution images. Today I'm going to show you a simple technique for doing this. One of the applications we frequently use here in the Structures Group is Photoscape. It's a free application that can do various types of image editing. It can be downloaded for free from photoscape.org. So on my desktop here, I have 16 images taken at high resolution. As you can see, the file sizes of these images are ranging from 2.4 to about 2.8 megabytes, which isn't terribly big, but I'm going to show you how to make them considerably smaller while maintaining the 4000 by 2248 pixel resolution. Once you've installed Photoscape, you'll want to open it and uh, select Batch Editor. Then select all the photos you'd like to edit. In this case, I'll go to the desktop and grab all 16 images and drag them into the work area. Once you've done that, click Convert All in the upper right and a dialog box will pop up. You'll want to choose Save Your Photo in the designated folder and choose your desktop or wherever the folder is where you save your images. Um, this will cause the images to be overwritten with your new smaller file sizes. The most important part is to move the slider under JPEG quality all the way over to the left until it reads 70. This is what reduces the file size considerably. Then click Save and it will ask if you want to overwrite the originals, which you'll want to. And that's it. If you're curious what the difference is between high quality JPEGs and low quality, I'll be doing a JPEG quality video where I compare images with different quality settings and show you how some cameras actually be, may actually be set to take the lower quality images initially. So back out on the desktop here, you can see how these images are four to five times smaller in size, but we still have that 4000 by 2248 resolution. This means we went from an original email size of about 40 megabytes down to eight to 10 megabytes, which is a big advantage when you're working with a lot of images. So that's all for now. Thanks for watching. And if you have any questions, please give us a call or send us an email. We'd be glad to help. Take care.